And joining us now is Ed Martin. He's the National Chairman of the National Catholic Committee on Scouting. Thanks so much for being with us, Ed. Thanks, Kevin. Um, maybe if you could start off by telling us a little bit about your, your duties or what are some of the things you do as the National Chair? Well, I'm the sort of the lead volunteer. I was elected to uh, oversee um, our executive board, which made up about 50, 50 other volunteers. Some are lay, some are clergy. And uh, we exist to pursue um, our mission, which is to promote scouting uh, programs of the BSA uh, within the Catholic Church. Talk a little bit about that, too, um, you know, the different regions and how that sort of uh, all coincides with each other. All right, well, we have 15 regions. They coincide with the uh, Episcopal regions uh, to help facilitate our relationship with the, the church. Our 15th region is actually uh, Eastern Rite. Um, we have representatives from um, those churches uh, to promote scouting with, within the, uh, their community. And um, uh, we have a regional leader uh, who's lay, and we also have an advisor who's a, a priest. And you, you talked a little bit about beforehand uh, your experience uh, with the uh, National Committee too and, and you're sort of moving through different phases uh, to getting to your position right now. But talk about your experience and how that has helped and, and shaped you and, and been able to help you in your national cheer role. All right, well I came up as a scout, um, Cub Scout, Boy Scout, earned the rank of Eagle. I also had an interest in uh, religious life. I attended a high school seminary. And uh, when I got out, um, uh, I had discerned that the religious life wasn't for me, but I felt that there was something I needed to do to give back to my community. And um, after college, I was uh, reintroduced to scouting from a former scoutmaster who got me involved in Catholic scouting as a religious emblems counselor. And um, I, then I got introduced to the National Catholic Committee on Scouting. I saw all the priests that were involved, and I saw it as a way for me to continue to give back for what had been given to me in the scouting program and as a way to better live out my faith. Um, so the two things I know best or want to know more about uh, my faith and uh, scouting, uh, National Catholic Committee on Scouting gave me the opportunity to do both. Talk about the committee itself too and how important it is to have something like this in the, as a presence uh, for the Boy Scouts to uh, across America. Well, youth today want to do what scouting offers. They want the outdoor activities. You want the opportunity to have fun, learn new things, be with other youth their own ages, and scouting provides that. Scouting also uh, serves as a program of youth ministry. When you look at uh, the eight components of youth ministry that Renewing the Vision um, identifies as uh, things that are required for a program to be a program of youth ministry, scouting, along with the programs of uh, the National Catholic Committee on Scouting, uh, fulfills all of those. So, um, we're a program that a Catholic organization can use as their own and, and be a program of Catholic youth ministry. Um, as the national chair, uh, your experience, uh, has that uh, you know, given you a new perspective on, on scouting itself and at now at a different level and seeing the different regions? Um, well, I've come to really uh, enjoy what scouting can offer. I think it provides an opportunity for those youth that want to make something of themselves, that want to um, understand uh, their role in their community and uh, become physically fit. Um, and I, I think as a Catholic, um, I, I know of no better program today that a Catholic church or organization can use to uh, relate best to their youth and bring them into the life of the faith community.